Hi guys! <laughs> I cannot! Hi guys! My name is Alea and I don't know, thank you for being here. If you're watching, I don't know, maybe this is for my future self or whatnot. And I hope Aya is not doing a story of me doing this. But I am going to do an unboxing. Again, it's not inside a box. But this is a, a product that I got from... Well, not exactly, okay? Because last weekend, we had the Philippine Dive Expo. And it was held um, in SMX in MOA. And we went there, we went around, um, I got some accessories also from Pacifica Dive uh, for my wetsuit, no, yeah, for my wetsuit and for my BCD. But then the Maris booth, they didn't have a lot of things. So my brother, his girlfriend, and myself, we ended up going uh, all over Makati to visit all of the other dive shops. And that is where I scored my new wetsuit. Initially, I think I mentioned in the channel that I was planning to get the fourth element um, Sinos wetsuit. However, I checked with Scuba Studio and I still don't have it. So, and I, I was actually having a hard time with the, the temporary wetsuit that I got um, at Nautilus because it was so tight around the neck and I just couldn't breathe. So, you know, I just decided to, why not score a new one? Thank you, Kuya Day. But anyway, I'm gonna show you. This is the Aya, I need you for this. <laughs> um, this is Aya, and we're doing this during our lunch break, by the way. So, yes. Um, Ta da! Oops, I think it's upside down. Okay, yeah. This is the new. Ma this is Aya. <laughs> Say hi. Hi. This is the new Marix Lexa She Dives Front Zip Wetsuit. Um, I tried it on several times already in the Maris store, but never really purchased it because it was at around 23,000 plus. But because of the Philippine Dive Expo, we got this for only around 16,000 something. So that is a really good deal. Um, I like this wetsuit because it has this glide skin seals. Well, well what, what do you call these things? These things are kind of like the water lock, water seal something, and that helps. I suppose I haven't tried this. Um, I just got it obviously now in the office. Um, the features are back and shoulder comfort system, extra warmth in unusually cold and sensitive areas, increased protection till shoulder for an increased comfort during diving because of course we carry our wetsuits here, right? I'm sorry, <laughs> we carry our BCDs here. And then glide skin seals. Glide skin is a special finish we use in our sealing system. Extremely smooth, it makes the suit easy to put on and remove while maintaining a great seal against the skin. And I promise you, I think the least favorite part about diving, or at least my least favorite part about it, is putting on the wetsuit. I don't know if some other divers will agree with me, but that is just really a challenge. I would end up sweating and really short of breath because it's really... A challenge and normally because I do have my nails done I just do it myself anyway but whenever I go diving these are like chipped and damaged and whatever but that's part of it um, so when I tried this on in Maris the first time I did I was so happy because it was so easy but then I checked the price and it was at, at around you know 23 so I was thinking okay if I was gonna get you know a Maris wetsuit versus a fourth element wetsuit at around the same price of course I will get the fourth element wetsuit so while waiting for that to arrive, because we don't have it yet here in the Philippines, I decided to purchase one, not the loose, so that I, I already have one that I can use whenever we go diving. That one was an Orca wetsuit at 4,500, already discounted at not the loose, so you can score it there as well if you want. But then, you know, I realized, I checked actually with um, Tofer of Scuba Studio, and they said that, uh, yeah, there are still a lot of back orders for the fourth element wetsuit so yeah and you know this is really a good deal come on 16,000 so um I'm getting ahead of myself third feature is a multi-purpose buckle hood attachment and flexa smart pocket attachment number four pocket area for flexa smart pocket fixation five instrument grip area six whistle zip 
Polar 7 Flip Fix. So, yeah, so this one is the back comfort system so that, you know, you still have like an extra padding for your back because we do have the tanks there, right? And then, um, what else? What else? Oh, this one. So they have here this part. So this part, actually, I'm gonna stand up for this. So in this part, you have a portion wherein you can attach your Maris. Uh, you have a buckle here as well. And you can attach your Maris um, pocket where you can put your, I don't know, maybe your camera, your knife, your um, torch, or whatever. You can put them here. But thing is, this one has um, Ziploc. No, <laughs> Velcro. This one has Velcro. And I actually already purchased one from Scuba Pro. And of course, you know, this is a different wetsuit. It has a different system. So mine doesn't have Velcro. The Scuba, sorry, the Scuba Pro pocket doesn't have one. And then I saw one in Maris, which of course fits this one perfectly. However, that's just, that's going to be another 2,700 something. Whereas the Scuba Pro one I got is, a, is more expensive. So the idea is to solve some Velcro straps on my Scuba Pro pocket so that I can affix it here with no problem. I also have this anyway and I, the Scuba Pro. I'll show you the video for the other one. Anyway, so this is the wetsuit. It's pretty. I like the color. It's white. It matches my BCD and um, also the uh, new accessories that I got for my BCD. Because before I had like black accessories for the BCD and now I have them in white, which is actually perfect. It matches also my fins, my Sea Wing Nova fins. This one has a front, I'm not sure if you can hear me, but this one has front zip. And I know a lot of people, a lot of divers aren't so keen on front zip wetsuits because, you know, they say you'd have to get more water in and whatnot. I haven't really tried this one, like I said earlier, so I'm not sure if that will happen. Regardless, you know, it's fine with me. Um, challenge, I guess, is to take it off. But, you know, you, we do have body system, so you can always ask someone to help you pop your shoulder out of it. But so far, when I tried it, I was able to remove it by myself solo so that's nice and what else do i like about oh yeah it's so freaking easy to put on and take off um yeah it would normally take me a long time after a lot of huffing and puffing to put on a wetsuit and remove it so it really takes up a lot of my energy and with this suit i can actually you know use that energy instead with when when i'm diving as opposed to putting on my wetsuit right um so there you go this is the maris yep i'm doing this for my lunch this is the maris flexa ultra stretch she dives wetsuit i'll put it on not in this video but on the next dive and i'll show you how it looks and how, and i'll give a review thank you Bye.